Now, the EFF Limpopo convener says the disbanded provincial leadership failed to increase the party's voter base. Dr. Mbuisen Ndlozi has now mandated branches to ensure an increase in number. The party has a plan to register one million members by the end of the year. Ndlozi launched the Capricorn leg of the campaign at Mafepe in Limpopo. New Zealand Africa's Belani Pahadi was there. The roads leading to this village are not maintained. But the EFF wants members and the road to one million active members leads to all corners of the country. Party supporters arrived at the local sports ground in their numbers, ferried from nearby villages, old and young, all clad in red. The gathering served businesses well. They made the much-needed money in this deep rural settlement. And once the EFF program started, one by one, supporters stood up to talk about their challenges. A fully operational clinic, maintained roads, and pregnant women struggling to get access to health facilities were among their challenges. And the typical political response filled with all the promises. Dr. Ndrozi said the EFF will keep its promises should they be voted into power in 2024. In order to achieve concerns raised by those supporting the party, the EFF in the province should be reconstructed from scratch, he said. There is a lot of um, uh, 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 demobilization that has happened on the ground, perhaps because of the internal contestations for the election of ward councillors. There's a lot of people that got demoralized in that process. There's a lot of people that felt aggrieved. So one of the biggest things that happened that must have hurt the EFF here is to having the pressure last year, and I don't know if you remember, of having to have to elect councillors in seven days. When we all thought elections are going to be postponed, when we all thought because of the COVID-19 conditions, there won't be a reasonable and fair and free election as the Khang Musenegas Commission indicated. The Constitutional Court said go to elections. We had to elect councillor candidates in seven days. The EFF has targeted to recruit 200 active members per ward and a million registered activists by the end of the year. There's no mention about what the current membership number is with Mbuisen in Joe's society that the party is currently going through an audit of its membership since 2013. Mbuisen Ndrozi is charged with the responsibility of reconstituting the EFF here in Limpopo. For Newsroom Africa, Channel 405, I'm Belane Pahadi in Mafefe, Limpopo.